today we're going to be trying out another awesome black ops one mod this one is called wds i am going to be calling it wds because i cannot pronounce if i try to pronounce this i will definitely butcher it but it adds a bunch of black ops 2 weapons black ops 3 weapons and a really awesome game ending easter egg based off of an item from modern warfare 2 i don't want to give away too much but let's just say by the end of this Kino will be no more. So let's get into it. I want to try some of these awesome weapons that are ported over to Black Ops 1. I'm very interested to see how they're going to work. There are some weapons that I never would have imagined being added to Black Ops 1. So let's see how they work. Let's get into this. Well, here we are on Kino Der Toten. Now, this mod is really cool. It does work on 5, Ascension, and Moon as well. So, if you guys do want to download this mod, it also works on those maps. So, as you can tell, we start off with the Mauser. Oh, dude, the knife animation is actually kind of fast. Look at this. That is sick. So, yeah, we got the Mauser as our starting weapon. The other weapons we have in the starting room are the Bulldog, I believe, right? Yeah, the Bulldog. And then over here where the M14 wall by is... We got the Ballista. I'm going to go ahead and buy, I think, the Bulldog. The Ballista we've had in uh, Black Ops 2 anyway, so it's probably going to be pretty good in the early rounds. Let's try out the Bulldog. This thing is awesome. Let's also get Quick Revive. Why not? Let's check out that perk icon. Shadow's perk icon. Hell yeah. Oh my goodness. This thing is insane. It sounds crazy. Look at this. <laughs> so yeah, there's a bunch of weapons that were ported over from black ops 2 black ops 3 ghost modern warfare remastered and infinite warfare but the awesome thing about this mod is it adds in a bunch of wonder weapons from those games including the staffs those are the ones that i want to try out i believe they have all four of the staffs uh, i'm not sure if you can pack a punch them i hope you can that would be really really awesome but hey we'll find out once we get them I really hope the box doesn't break on this mod. If you guys watched the previous mod that I covered, it was called Project 115. And that mod, unfortunately, for some reason, the mystery box just randomly broke. It just would not let me hit the box. Like, the box would be in the location, but I couldn't open it. I would have to wait for fire sales. It was uh, really, really weird. So I hope that doesn't happen this time because I do want to try out a bunch of weapons. And then also, like I said at the beginning, there is a awesome Modern Warfare 2 nuke that I definitely want to try. You activate that and it actually blows up Kino. It just ends the game. I really want to see that as well in action. But we're definitely going to be hitting the box a lot. I'm going to be trying out a bunch of different weapons. And uh, we'll try to pack a punch as many weapons as I can. But once I grab that item, I really want to pop it. Oh, a double points. Nice. So yeah, it looks like we have the shadows perk icons. Oh, I gotta love the shadows icons, man. It's pretty iconic. <laughs> if you get what I'm saying. And we'll also take a look around the map and see what else is added in. I do not know if there's any other things added. I'm curious to see. We'll definitely open up the entire map. Uh, all i really seen, though... Well, usually what I like to do with mods is not really look too much into it. I kind of like to skim over what it adds. Just so it doesn't spoil anything for me. But, uh, yeah. I did take a look at some of the weapons. But uh, all the other features of the mod, I didn't really pay attention to too much. I always like to be surprised with these mods. It's always awesome to just play them like that instead of taking a look at everything it adds in. Um... So yeah, let's go ahead and I guess we'll wait for the dog ground. Why not? We have a shotgun. We're going to destroy them. And then we'll open up. I was going to open up, but let's just wait a little bit. Let's find out where the box is at. Hopefully it's not over there in the alley or in the <laughs> top left-hand corner. Please don't be in there. Let's hope it's closer. Okay, not here. Actually, let's see what weapon's over here. What, what is this? It, it was the PM63 before. Now it is the PDW. Okay. Let's see what's over here where the stakeout was at. Oh, it's the Remington. Okay. Wait, how much is that Remington? 15. Still no box, though. The MP40 is still there. I love that they kept it there. <laughs> the MP40 on Black Ops 1 is amazing. I guess let's just keep going. We'll kill them as they come. So we have the VMP as well. In the dressing room. Oh, the box right there. Nice. Okay, let's hit that thing. <laughs> what the... <laughs> <laughs> I think that's the tactical nuke. Oh, we got the weevil. No, I just got rid of my damn Mauser. Oh my goodness. I was gonna keep it. Damn it. I just got too excited. Uh, I hope the Mauser's in the mystery box. <laughs> Please. Well, <laughs> damn it. Oh, we got the S12. Uh, yeah, let's get rid of the bulldog now. We tried it a, tried it a good amount of time already. 
I'm not going to grab that nuke. I kind of want to cycle as many weapons as I can right now. Oh, we actually got the lightning staff. Okay, the animation looked nice when I picked it up. Let's see. Let's try this thing out. Wow, yeah, this is pretty cool. It's like the Wonder Waffle effect. Yeah, yeah, this is awesome. Damn. And the reload animation, too, looks clean. We got a staff already. Let's go. Let's start saving up. Oh, and it even has the twirl animation. Bro, this is so satisfying. I always do this every time I get the staff. Like, for a good 30 seconds, too. It is so sick. I don't know what it is about it. <laughs> oh, yeah, we should actually check if we can pack a punch the staff. We'll start saving for pack a punch. I'll probably try to pack a punch it first, and then we'll buy perks. <laughs> Just because I'm so curious. We almost have enough for it. We'll stay over here, and then we'll teleport immediately. This is sick, man. No shot we can pack punch the lightning staff on Kino, man. Wait, how much points do I get? Ten? Oh, wait, never mind. Okay. It's for the Nova Crawlers. Ooh. I'm going to chill here, and then once I get Jug, I'll probably do the... Um, the alley strat for a little bit. The alley strat's a little bit more fun. This spot's just chaotic. Okay, let's uh, let's go see. Can we pack punch it? <laughs> let's see. Oh, it's the origins pack a punch as well. Let's see. Yo, we can, and it went in vertically. It didn't even go in horizontally. Whoa, what does it become? Kamat's bites. Oh, this is sick. Can we, can we charge it? It actually charges! Oh my goodness, that's awesome. And I, I missed. Wait, did that hit? No, it didn't. <laughs> it looks like it's right above him. Is this some Texas? Oh no, it's, it's just normal grenades. Alright, hey, dude! And there's four staffs. So we got the lightning one first. Let's try out... Uh, let, let's see if we can maybe get the other staffs as well. Here, let's try the charge shot. So we got it maxed out. Boom. Yeah. Yeah, dude, this is awesome. <laughs> this is awesome. Yes. I'm so happy we could pack a punch them. I definitely do want to try out all the other staffs too. See if we get lucky with them. I don't know if I can carry multiple staffs at once. It might only let me have one staff at a time. Uh, I wouldn't doubt if it did. So I might have to trade out the lightning staff before I start hitting for the other ones. Uh, but we'll, you know, we'll try to use this lightning staff for a good amount of time. I gotta get, you know, points and set up first, and then I'll probably start hitting for other wonder weapons. Oh, wait, uh, let's take a look at the weapons that are on the wall in this area. I completely forgot to check for that. So over here where the M16 used to be, we have the AK? Oh, no, the AK-12. Okay. Over here where Jug's at, we have the Galvanicles. Nice. Look how fast we knife. I think this is from Ghost, isn't it? Imagine this, but with the Galvin Knuckles. It's going to be crazy. <laughs> yeah, I am very, very broke. We don't even have enough to open up to the alley. I guess I'll save up this round just for the alley. And then we'll leave. Yeah, this stuff is going to be awesome. I think the Wind Staff is going to be the best one in the alley. If I can get the Wind Staff... Bro, like, the Thunder Gun is already so good for the alley strats. Imagine the wind stuff and how fast it can shoot and how much ammo it has. Dude, it's going to be awesome. It's going to be awesome. And I keep on missing. I got to shoot, like, lower. I keep on trying to shoot directly, and it goes above. I got to shoot low. Yeah, 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 they, that's what's happening. Okay, let's open up to the alley. Let's see what's in that area. Uh, we'll open up through this side. I don't know if I'll open up the top left area. I mean, I guess we will later on, but I don't want to open that up too soon. We'll get the MP5. Sweet, instead of the MPL. Double tap. Yes, sir. What do we have? We're the... Uh, oh, the AK-74U stays. <laughs> so, yeah, this is where things start to get a little bit more fun. The spawns are a lot faster. I'm going to try to just get a ton of points, and then we'll start just hitting the box for other things. Because I definitely want to get rid of the Weevil. I want to try another weapon. And then maybe we'll get something else while we're getting something else for the Weevil. You know what? Oh, let's actually get double tap. Let's see if it's double tap 2.0. I mean, it's going to be a little bit hard to tell, I guess. Or maybe not. It didn't say double tap 2.0. It just said normal double tap. Let's see. Oh, yeah. I think this is definitely... Yeah, this is definitely 2.0. Yeah, yeah. It's definitely. Yep. 100%. <laughs> you just tell. Oh, double points. Nice. Okay, so I'm going to save a zombie at the end of this round. And we'll go hit the box. 
Maybe we'll get the tactical nuke. It's so funny how the tactical nuke just floats. <laughs> in the box. It doesn't even show any of the other weapons. It just shows the tactical nuke. I love it. Oh, a max ammo. Oh, I wonder if there's a perk limit. Uh, we might test that out. I don't know what perk I should get. Because Mule Kick would be cool so I can carry more of these weapons to try out. But Speed Cola is kind of a necessity. The Emtar, nice, nice, nice. Oh, this sounds, this sounds good. The models look amazing. It literally feels like I'm playing <laughs> like Black Ops 2 or Black Ops 3. I don't think I'll carry a shotgun. Oh, the SMR. Do you think it's better than Black Ops 2? <laughs> you, let's try it out. This is going to be a little bit scary. You know what? Just for the memes, I'll pack a punch it. Oh, wait. I don't have it linked. Let's link it. Just for the memes, let's pack a punch the SMR. I want to try it out. Maybe <laughs> the devs made it slightly better than the Black Ops 2 version. Let's see. Sadness manifested in reality. Wow, that what a name. Oh, what is a scope? That is a very awesome scope. It's like sideways. I can't even see where I'm supposed to aim. <laughs> oh, we're, we're in here. Give me the real, give me the real, give me the real. Nice. The camo looks awesome. I, I love this camo. Wait, is the camo animated? Let me see. Oh, it kind of looks like it is. I don't think it is, though. Look at this. Yeah, this is so good. And the ammo, man. Okay, we're going to have to spam this a little bit. <laughs> I love this mod, dude. All these weapon mods are so cool. We got a lot of Nova Crawlers, so sheesh. Hey, the SMR is actually good in this mod. <laughs> we'll try this out for this next round, and then we'll go swap out for another weapon. I think we'll just do it that way. We'll just kind of play around with a weapon, swap it out. Oh, it's dog round. Oh, it's fine. We'll uh, we'll still use it for an extra round. We have a lot of ammo, and I need a lot of points anyway. Uh, No, nothing is in here. Okay. What about down here? Anything, anything, anything? No. Okay. Sweet. Hey, you never know. Gotta check. Gotta check. Ooh, Scar. Eesh, this is gonna be hard to get rid of. I really want to try this out. Oh, nice. Okay, well, it looks like the game decided for me. Should we get Mule Kick? What's the reload speed on this thing? Eesh. Wait, actually, hold on. Can we reload cancel? Kinda. The reload's not that bad. So, let's let, let's go get Mule Kick. And we will see if we can maybe get Speed Coal if there's no perk limits. But I do want to get Mule Kick for this case. Uh, big L for the Speed Cola enjoyers. Trust me, I would have chose Speed Cola as well. But I just want to try out different weapons. So, yeah. Uh, oh, the box is actually on this side. Okay. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, the DSR. Classic. Sure. Wait, is this not one shot anymore? <gasps> Whoa, wait. Is this like... Wait, hold on. It didn't even kill anything. Bro, whoa. Oh, hold on. Maybe charging it now. Okay, this is very dangerous. Wait, hold on. What's happening right now? Hold on. Let's charge it all the way. And then we'll do a direct shot. Damn, so I got to charge now. Yeah, because look, if I shoot directly into the horde, it seems like it does hit, but it doesn't doesn't fully kill. Very interesting. That's going to make camping in here a little bit harder now. <laughs> damn okay well we're gonna have to use these weapons then because it's it's too crazy trying to train them all like this 
Oh, a fire sale. Okay, I'm going to put the staff in then. Let's see if we can get another one. Wow, that's a disgrace. I traded it for the 5-7 dual wield. <laughs> hey, the RPG. Long time no see. I'm not going to keep this, though. Come on, give me something else. Oh, the ray gun. One more, one more, one more, one more, one more. I mean, I'll take the ray gun. Okay, let's pack punch the scar then. I mean, hey, we got the ray gun. That's, that's pretty cool. I love the shininess on these weapons. I, I, like, I don't know what it is. It just, it, it, it looks more realistic almost. I, I don't know. I like it a lot though. I don't know if I should do the alley strat then because I don't really have a wonder weapon to back me up. The ray gun is good. I guess we'll test it out. Maybe it's a lot better in this mod. Uh, we'll test it out. But I don't know if I feel safe in the alley anymore. Seems to be very risky. Let's put the reel in. Let's get the scar in there. A Garth and Reaper. Oh, and the scope is kind of the same. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, we got blessed with the double points. Is the reel in here? If I have to open up the door, I will. But that's behind me. Let's try out the Vepper. Oh my goodness, the fire rate on this thing is crazy. And it has 42 shots. Jeez. Feels like I got a, a death machine. Oh, max ammo. Okay, let's grab that. Okay, we got more points. Let's go dump them again. <laughs> Moment of truth. Can we do it? No! Why perk limits? Why? Well, at least now if I go down, I'll just buy it. <laughs> Instead of mule kick, maybe. Depending on our weapons, of course. I don't even know which one's my mule kick weapon. I think it's the ray... No, it's... is it the ray gun? No, I think it's the vepper. Is it the vepper? Oh, man. I think... Oh, I traded the ray gun. No, this is one. And then I think... Yeah, the Vepper has to be the third slot. It has to be. Because the staff was in my second slot. And what I had before the scar was... Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa dual wield. What the hell? Wait, what? The, uh, the executioner in the cat 40? Dual wield? What? Am I, what am I what am I playing right now? I didn't what? They got crossover dual wields. I don't even know cross That's so sick. Wow, that is really really cool. I I need to pack punch these. That is so damn cool. I wonder what other dual wield weapons have like one of each. I thought it was two cap 40s, but this is sick, man. This is so weird to use. Hold on. I gotta get used to this real quick. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, hold on. <laughs> it's so weird because, like, one. Ah! ah! Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ah! It's so weird because, like, one you hold down and the other one you gotta cheat. Hold on, I gotta. Okay, okay, okay. I got it. I got it now. I got it now. <laughs> I sort of panicked because I didn't know which one. It's always like inverted, you know what I mean? Like the left mouse button, it shoots the right gun. I definitely will pack a punch these weapons still. It just definitely throws you off. Whoa, that's so weird. They share ammo. Even though they're two completely different weapons. <laughs> Alright, let's try this out. What do they look like? What's the name? Voice of Justice and Karmic Adam Perforator 4000. Jeez, what a name. And still, unfortunately, the Executioner only has 5 shots, and the Cap 40 has 15. It seems like the Executioner is significantly weaker. Look at this. It takes about 3 shots. Meanwhile, the Cap 40 destroys. Let's see. Let's test this out. 1. Hold on. 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 shots, yeah. Oh, let's see. Dual wield. Oh, it's uh, 5 7s. 
we're not gonna be taking that no 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 I really went down oh my goodness oh my goodness I'm so stupid I don't know why I I don't know why I try to turn around like that what the hell's happening with the zombie I was gonna say what is what was that no we freaking went down I gotta open this door now okay things are gonna get slightly scary now we gotta go we gotta go we gotta go we gotta go no way I went down damn man oh and we lost the dual wield weapon son of a brother go 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 no first down we got a down on 21 that is that is unfortunate <laughs> all right well let's just end the round all right um let's go buy back our perks so i guess this time we'll get speed cola i really i don't know i feel like meal kick is definitely good but speed cola is gonna help out so much so much more I'd rather speed cola now. <laughs> um, we'll definitely keep on trying different weapons and stuff. Hopefully, we get a wonder weapon soon. Uh, like, come on, please give me a staff. But I don't know. I feel like for the most part, two weapons is perfect right now. Yep. Oh, it actually does say double tap two right there. Never mind. That looks like I was wrong. Whoa! We got the R seven hundred. It looks so weird in the box. <gasps> what the blunder gets shut up with uh, the blunder gets and i thought this was just like a normal shotgun Ooh, brm now nah, we're gonna keep the galil it's a must we, we need to keep the galil dude the blunder gets should destroy we have double tap 2.0 with it i'm definitely gonna pack punch this as well oh the mg08 oh that is ooh. i think i'm gonna keep this yeah, yeah, I, I think I'm going to keep this. All right, let's just use this for this round. Oh, my goodness, this is going to be awesome. But, yeah, I'm not going to be training in the alley anymore. We definitely do not want that. Hey, we got dog round. Yeah, the alley is just super dangerous. I, I, I don't want to. I don't want to go down there anymore. <laughs> Blunder gets. Imagine if it added the acid get or something to it. The sweeper. Now we are just going to be saving points. I just want to hit the box now. And trying to get that nuke. That's all we want. Oh, in a fire sale. Let's go. I am a little broke. So this is pretty good. It's pretty good. Oh my god, we got the PPSH. Oh my god, we got the PPSH. Um okay, I don't think. <laughs> <laughs> the boys know the PPSH is my favorite weapon in zombies. But it's hard, man. We got the Blunder Guy, which is one of my favorite wonder weapons of all time. And we have my favorite weapon of all time. So it's kind of hard. I don't know what to choose anymore to, like, get rid of. Oh, my God. This is going to be rough. It's definitely going to be a tough choice, man. <laughs> Especially without Mule Kick. I, I think I'm just going to hit the box first. Yeah, I just, the PPSH is so sick, it has so much ammo, and once I pack punch it, especially with this, it's probably going to be crazy good. So I don't want to get rid of it. This is going to be our point weapon. And I guess the sweeper will be our safety. Oh, what the? Oh, I thought that was the blender get twice. I'm pretty much just going to be hitting the box for just this nuke. Might be a little bit boring to watch, so I'll probably cut this out. Especially because we're just letting the weapons sink back into the box. Let's see what round I get this damn nuke on, man. Bro, yeah, we make so much points with this PPSH. We have to keep this. <laughs> like, look at this. In one round, we already have 12k. But yeah, if you guys do have any recommendations for any other mods, I should try out. Whether it's Black Ops 1, Black Ops 3, or World at War. Definitely let me know down below. I always look for some cool ones. I try to find some stuff that uh, is pretty interesting. So, yeah, I mean, if you guys have any suggestions, definitely let me know. Oh, we got the lightning staff again. We haven't seen any other staff, though. <laughs> it looks hilarious. Oh, the fire staff. Oh, man, this is hard. I got to do it for the video. I'm sorry, PPSH. 
We got the fire staff. I gotta do it. I couldn't get rid of the sweeper because this thing is so good too. All right, let's take a shot at this. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, that looks sick. <laughs> it looks so cool. Look at that. All right, well, we'll try this out. Hopefully it doesn't suck. The lightning staff started getting really bad. Even pack punched uh, round, what was it, 17? Man, that's, that's, that's pretty low. Hopefully the fire stuff is not like that. To be fair though, isn't the lining stuff like a little bit weaker than the other stuffs anyway? Uh, let's pack punch this thing. I mean, to be fair, we did make a video getting the PBSH on every single map. Uh, so, you know, I guess it is fair. We already gave the PBSH a lot of time. If you guys haven't checked out that video, make sure you check it out. It's going to be linked down below in the pinned comment. Shameless plug. But yeah, we got the PBSH on every Treyarch Zombies map. It was so much fun. Uh, what was it? From Black Ops? No, from World at War to vanguard so yeah definitely make sure to check that out it was a lot of fun to make uh i had to dedicate a i had to dedicate one whole video to the ppch because that thing is so awesome so let's charge this thing oh wow okay yeah that's sick that is so cool that it's on black ops one bro so damn sick let's check this out yeah that's awesome oh and it even does like Oh, wait, no, I thought that was that was the lighting. I thought that was the fire. I thought it was still, like, burning in that area. <laughs> Dude, yeah, this is so good. I might get rid of the blunder get then. Because the thing is, I was kind of nervous. I I, I didn't want to get rid of the blunder get because I thought this was going to be bad. And if this was going to be bad, then I would have just no good weapons. But no, dude, this is awesome. This is so good. Wow, man. Yes. Yes! This is exactly what we needed. You know what? Yeah, we gave the Blender Get enough time to marinate. Let's get the AK-12. Uh, we'll just train here, getting as many points as we can get. This thing is, is still good on round 26. Then again, Double Tap 2.0 does make everything good. But yeah, this thing is this thing is solid. Plus the ammo is so cheap, it's going to be awesome. Well, at least we had a chance to check out one of the other staffs. It took us a very long time to even get the staff back out of the box. It's funny that we got the lightning staff twice. <laughs> I'm just going to switch out my weapon anyway. Like, I'll just buy the AK-12 whenever I want to get it back. Oh, you can have two. Wow. You can have two staffs. Wow, we got the... We got the... I can't believe we got the staff three times. <laughs> <laughs> and we got the MG-08 back. Hell yeah. Oh, we got it. We got it. Yes. Bring out C4 to activate nuke. Let's go. We actually got it. Okay, let's hit the box a little bit more uh, to see if I can maybe get like a new weapon or something. But man, let's go. So yeah, as you can tell in my inventory, it looks like C4, but it is the nuke. Okay, we got the teddy bear. Sweet. <laughs> but um... Yeah, let's go ahead and pop this thing. Let's go to the alley. I want to see what it looks like outside. Um, but, man, this mod is really cool. It has a bunch of awesome weapons. I believe it even has the Mark III in the box, the Apothic and Servant, a lot of other amazing wonder weapons. If you guys want to check this mod out, definitely check it out. It's going to be linked down below in the pinned comment as well. Now, if you guys do want to see gameplay of the Apothic and Servant, the Raygun Mark III, I have made a video of another mod called Project 115. It's sort of similar to this mod. I'm very happy that um, we actually got the sort of exclusive wonder weapons or some of the exclusive wonder weapons from this mod because they have similar weapons. It's like similar weapon pool. They don't have the exact same weapons and the exact same perks and everything. Uh, Project 105 is a little bit different. It's it's a little bit cooler too because it has um, different bosses and whatnot. So I'm glad we at least got to experience the lightning stuff and the fire stuff. The fire stuff is really, really awesome. But let's go ahead and pop this nuke. Let's see what it looks like. Bop. And then bop. Let's see. Is that all we had to do? Oh, we, we had to throw it. Oh, okay. I was going to say, this is so damn cool. Ah, uh, and the slow-mo twirly. Let's go. <laughs> okay, we just blew up Kino with myself in it. What the? <laughs> That's so sick, dude. That's awesome. But yeah, I will catch you guys on the next one. We won zombies. We did it. We beat zombies. 
Let's go. If you guys do want to see me play this mod on other maps, because again, like I said, it is available on Ascension, Moon, and 5. If you guys want to see me play this mod on those maps as well, let me know by hitting that like button. And I appreciate you guys' support recently. You guys are awesome. But yeah, make sure to hit the like button. Hit that subscribe button if you guys are new. Comment down below what I should do next. And I'll see you all on the next one, boys. Peace out. Have a good one. Take care, boys. Peace, peace, peace.